are here attending the rehearsal of Setu's upcoming production, Kamala. And this is a very, very special production. And we have with us Jayanti, who is one of the founding members of Setu. So welcome to Foundations TV. Thank you. Thank you for giving us the opportunity. Absolutely a pleasure. Now, this uh, production is very special. So why don't you share with the audience uh, what is special about this one? Well, first of all, it's a great play. But more uh, than that, Shetu actually began its life with this play back in 2003. Um, the script is written by the famous playwright, the late Vijay Tendulkar. And uh, he actually came to Boston and we went to meet him at MIT. Um, he wanted to see his characters. Um, it was wonderful. And then we did the play about five or six times between 2003 and I would say 2005. Uh, and then of course we went to other uh, productions and did a lot. But then finally um, we decided to do this play again with uh, almost all new cast except for uh, Shubrata and I are the same ones, the husband and wife in the play. Uh, the play is not only famous and the script is wonderful, of course direction is great by Shubrata, but also unfortunately uh, the topic is still very relevant. Mm. Um, this journalist goes to a village to buy a woman to prove that slave trade is going on and if you I'm sure you've read the news uh, articles recently, even now, things like that do go on, not just in India, all over the world. Mm. Um, and the way uh, the journalist treats his own wife, mm. almost like a slave. Oh. So um, it's a very nicely uh, intricate interwoven play with those topics in it. So it's not just about the slave trade, right. it's about relationships. Wow. And there's a lot of opportunity to act. So we're trying our best. I'm sure it'll be wonderful. Yeah, <laughs> to I'm present sure. um, a good play to our audience. So uh, you did say this was the first production of Seto. So what was the motivation to uh, do it again, showcase it again? Oh, um, nostalgia. Yeah. Um, because we had, I, I can only speak for myself really, sure, because yeah. uh, the role that I'm playing is the wife of the journalist, Sarita. It has always been my most favorite role. Really? Everything that, out of all the ones that I have done. Really? So I always, I kept saying to Shubrata, let's do it again, let's do it again. Okay. And uh, it's all because it has only six characters, and you know, Shetu wants to involve uh, the whole community and a lot of new actors. Right. So we, we took our time. So right. this time we felt like it's, it's time again to do this. And there is double casting in the play, so it's not just going to be six people. Okay. There's going to be actually a total of eight people. Okay. Uh, so to give it, give uh, passionate actors a chance sure. to dis display the same characters on two different shows. Okay. Um, so, and the audience will also enjoy a little bit different interpretation by different actors. Mm. Interesting. Now, uh, sp speaking of interpretation by the actor, you being the actor and also a co-founder um, and now playing a particular character role that you played many years ago, mm -hmm. if you were to describe this role in the sense, let's say using adjectives, what would be the adjectives you would use for this particular character? Well, um, she's, she's a very modern woman, mm. educated, sophisticated. She even used to ride horses, but with the traditional way of getting married and she's been kind of, became very submissive doing just being a housewife, a very submissive one, um, which is nothing uncommon. It, it, right. It's so a very traditional role. Women who come watch it may be even to right. be able to relate to that particular part of this right. character. Finally, she does wake up, but I don't want to give it all away. Sure, of course. Um, yeah. Actually, I remember one time back in 2003 when I played the character at the end, um, a motherly woman, a little bit older, came to me and she was actually had tears in her eyes. She said, I felt like I was, I was in my own living room and I was experiencing my life. Right. 
which I thought was a nice, uh, that was my gift. Oh. <laughs> so that was, wow. yeah. There's a lot of opportunity to show emotion and right. acting. Right. This is why it's my favorite role. So you played it uh, like 13 years ago? Yes. And now you're playing it again. So I'm sure you've gathered a lot, a lot of experiences yes. in your life. Uh, do you feel different playing this role now after so many years? Um, not just from life. Actually, I've been acting for so many years and especially we tried to do it as professionally as possible of different characters. Um, I have learned a lot yeah. through, uh, you know, directors and just from acting. Um, so I'm just, I'm just having fun because now I can hopefully uh, portray a lot, a little bit differently, maybe not as a novice actor anymore. It's more so mature, uh, more mature, yeah, yeah. more mature. <laughs> <laughs> and um, if I wait too much longer, I probably couldn't play this role. So, yeah. <laughs> so um, I'm looking forward to it. Wonderful. And I hope that uh, we can we can do uh, justice to the characters and to the play. And uh, it would be great to have appreciative audience. I'm sure you will. I'm sure. As always, Setu uh, outdoes themselves. You guys do such a great job. And uh, with you and Shubhrito, part of this uh, being on stage That's together. also very special because right. we've been, since 2003, we've been in so many different productions. He even posted something that he, we fight about right, things. Right, right, so right, this right. time we're actually fighting on stage. So, <laughs> uh, something to look forward to. <laughs> So. Well, we do hope everybody can come watch uh, Shubhrato and Jayanti together on stage. Coming up soon, March 31st to April 2nd, Kamala by Setu. All the best. Thank you.